Hey guys, Professor Bill, Comic Book University and Avengers, issue number 698. Can we not get a glare on that one? Oh, there we go. Uh, 685, actually. 685. And this is part 11 of 16 of No Surrender. Okay. Now, first off, when I saw this cover, I'm telling you right now, dude, I was, I was thinking to myself, yeah, dude's going to die. General Maverick's going to die in this one. Because I saw this cover some time ago. You know, they showed the, the covers as a preview. I'm like, oh, cool. He puts on the Iron Patriarch. So it's the Iron Hulk. Cool. You know, whatever. It must be some desperate situation for him to put it on. We'll see. And then last week, I saw the cover again at the end of uh, part 11, or part 10 of No Surrender. So th and he was facing off against the Hulk. So I'm thinking, oh, yeah, he going to die. So they got the new immortal Hulk. Same old Hulk, but proven to be immortal now. And they're going to go into the, you know what? I'm not even going to get into that. Go and check out my uh, uh, On the Horizon Marvel's Fresh Start to get what's coming up with Marvel in the future and my opinions on it. Okay. So what happens in this comic is exactly what you see on the front cover. It is a battle against the Red Hulk. Now, Immortal Hulk does something in here that the original Red Hulk, Thunderbolt Ross, did to him some time ago. He absorbs the radiation, the gamma radiation, inside uh, General Maverick. Now, General Maverick loses apparently all of it because his skin is no longer even red. His skin is now white. Like, he, he's, he's a white guy again. You know what I'm saying? So that's that's interesting. It's interesting. Uh, he got into a fight with the Hulk and, and lost, but came out better than he was before that. Okay. Okay. I'm, I can buy it. Uh, but then an even bigger battle happens. Yeah, Scarlet Witch uses her uh, probability manipulation and reality manipulation in order to wake up the Vision again. So Vision goes at it big time with the Hulk, the immortal Hulk. And something later on, um, Sam Gunthrie and, uh, you know, the Cannonball and Lightning, the former Living Lightning, get into it with the uh, uh, Black Swan and what's her name? Proxima Midnight. So interesting, interesting fight. Uh, yeah, a lot of, lot of crazy stuff happens here, including Vision. I'm just saying, you guys are going to want to see what happens to Vision. You guys are going to want to go, grab the comic, pick it up, <laughs> buy it, at the very least, <laughs> take a look at what happens to Vision in this one. It is... I I, I sat back <laughs> when I read it. I looked at it, I was like, oh my. Anyway, hiding in the vault is Voyager. She's in a, uh, the vault in this area, and uh, Hulk is going after to try and get it. Now, Grandmaster's freaking out, like, hey, dude, you know, v uh, Voyager, what's up? I need you to I need you to come back, hon. You know, it's his, his daughter. It's like, I need to come back into the playing field. Uh, we got to finish this, all right? We can finish this battle right now. And she's like, yeah, I'm not your pawn anymore. Sorry, done. It's like, dude, are you kidding me? What a time to rebel against your dad. But you know what? She's a planner, too. Like, father, like daughter, right? So, um... Next issue is going to be interesting. I really debated showing you this last page, but I'm going to show you the last page only because I think that there, there are, there's two major fights with the Immortal Hulk in here, and they're good. So I think that's good enough to get the comic. Either way, the last reveal is going to make you want to get next week's, I think. Yeah. Yeah. But, um, Wonder Man shows up and he's like, hey, Hulk, do you have time to talk? Because I'd really like to talk. Remember, he's a pacifist now. They're still going with the pacifist thing. So that being the case, he's not going to want to fight the Hulk. What do you think the Hulk's going to want to do, though? You know what I'm saying? It's one of those things where it's like, you know, Hulk, I don't want to fight you. You say no, Hulk says yes. Guess what the answer is? It's a resounding yes with a thunderclap. Anyway, I'm looking forward like crazy to see the next issue. I have got to see what the heck is about to happen here. Wow. <laughs> and, he, and Simon Williams left uh, Scarlet Witch just a little bit, you know, with a little bit of a suicidal kind of idea. He's like, yeah, uh, at least if I don't come back, I'll be out of your life. Whoa, slow burn because you got rejected, brah. Brah. Calm yourself, man. Plenty of fish in the sea, you know? Anyway, they're not all drawn like her. So <laughs> I'm going to give this comic book an A-. minus. This was fantastic. This is great, man. I'm telling you, you got an all-star writing team on this, dude. Like, what's that? Who, who sings that song, um, All-Star? Anyway, uh, that's what I think of when I'm reading these comic books sometimes, because it's just so good. So good. All right, guys, that's it for me. Professor Bill, Comic Book University. Class dismissed.